Hey, what's going on you guys? It's Barbarian and welcome to another Minecraft seed highlight video. And uh, today we have an awesome seed for you guys, Tori Black. Now Tori Black is an amazing woman. She is very beautiful and uh, I'm sure you guys will have fun doing a lot of individual research as we always have fun, uh, you know, doing that. If you guys can see on screen now, I think you guys will definitely want to, you know, do some research, quote unquote. But 1.3 has changed the way we do seed highlight videos. And until everyone's really caught up, I want to kind of show you guys exactly what we're going to have to do. The main thing that you're going to want to do is basically just, you know, follow my instructions on screen. You can allow cheese that does not affect it at all. Uh, structures, you want to leave that on. World type, you want to leave the default. You can have it as super flat or large biomes. Now, you want to have it as default. The, the, trust me, that's what you're going to want to do. Uh, bonus chest, you can turn on or off. Does not matter either. So type in Tory Black, capital T, capital B for your seed. Click done, and then make sure you're in creative mode. And go ahead and create your world. Now, this is actually a kind of a different seed because you have to go quite a bit of ways to actually get to the seed. Um, now, you know, I'm not sure if you guys have actually used 1.3 all that much lately, but there is a new feature for 1.3, and that's called the TP command. Excuse my squeaking ski my squeaking keyboard. Um, if you type a T to start the chat, and then type slash TP and hit enter, it'll show you how to use the TP command. You want to type TP slash or slash TP target player, which in my case would be my account name, and then uh, you know I want to type in the coordinates. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. I'm going to type slash TP. This is where you add your account name. You can just press tab and it'll finish it in if you type the first letter. And then I'm going to type in the coordinates. And the coordinates you want to type in in this order are this: negative 285, and then 65, and then negative 1714. So that's going to bring you to the seed that we need to go to. I'm not really sure why I just fell. Don't worry, that won't happen. That, that's just a uh, kind of a bad side effect. And as the seed loads, you'll see we're in another mountain biome. And this mountain biome is kind of unique in the sense that it's more a majestic mountain biome than anything really weird or you know awesome. Uh, not to say that this is an awesome mountain biome. I wouldn't be showing it to you guys if it wasn't. Uh, but this is more like a realistic one. And you can see over here, there's a little bit of an overlap. I mean, there's some overlaps. There's a little bit of a uh, kind of like a hole that you can go down on, down under down under here. Uh, I'm not really sure if you guys would actually like to explore the inside of a mountain, but if you want to, you certainly can. Uh, this is definitely an option here. And, you know, it comes out right there. But the main thing that I want to show you guys is this side of the mountains. It's really cool. It actually looks like a realistic mountain biome or a realistic mountain wood. Uh, you know, it's kind of like a gentle slope up to so the point where you can climb up. But also just huge as far as, you know, look at it. It even includes some sand, which I think is really cool. And, uh, you know, you come over here. It's got this, you know, just basically rolling hills. And there's a giant ass tree on top of there. Um... I'm not sure if that's going to spawn in when you do the seed, but if it does, that's really awesome. But, you know, rolling. And then over here, we've got cows and just more smooth rolling hills, as well as this, you know, mountain biome, so to speak, sort of actually transfers into the snow, which is really neat. Uh, you don't often see frozen mountains, as I like to call them, but uh, they are here, and it looks like you could actually make this a pretty decent home. You come under here, a little bit of a hideaway I guess you could say you could hide under there in case it starts snowing I'm not really sure why you would want to do that but you could if you wanted to and uh, you know just kind of just all around a really cool see there's a little bit of an in inlet right there and you come around the back side and as always there's more you know kind of neat stuff there's just a sheer cliff you could build your house up there and look down under here I mean that's always an option or you could just build your house in here this is also a pretty cool area to build you know this could be like your little hidden away cavern I guess you could say but you know regardless this is definitely a seed that you're going to want to build on and you're going to want to check out because underneath I'm sure there's countless dungeons and you know maybe even a stronghold or two uh, definitely definitely worth checking out so if you guys did like this video and you want to see more seed highlights with the porn stars then go ahead and leave a rating because that kind of you know shows me that you guys really do enjoy the video and that you want to see more also if you haven't already subscribed to my youtube channel youtube.com slash sgc barbarian you can go ahead and check that out the link will be in the description i post daily minecraft content as well as a variety of other games including call of duty black ops edition you know modern warfare 3 edition uh what do we got borderlands i'm going to be starting up soon so all around a lot of different variety and uh, a lot of games i think you guys will probably enjoy so um anyway guys it's been real it's been fun it's been real fun but uh as always my name is barbarian peace out